So just a few weeks back, we introduced Felt 2.0, which includes powerful spatial analysis tools and a sleek new user interface. In today's video, I wanna focus on three aspects of the new UI design in particular that really enhance the user experience. One of the first things you might notice is that the toolbar is significantly smaller and it's been moved from the bottom to the top. This really frees up space and helps you see more of the map. It's gorgeous. We've also incorporated drop-down menus and brought some of the essential tools more front and center. For example, you can now more prominently see the comment button as well as upload from URL, which our power users have come to love as an upload method for their tile URLs, Esri feature server layers, and Google Sheets. In Felt 2.0, we've made it easier for users to move between editing and presenting mode. All you need to do is click on this play button in the top right hand corner of your screen. That will bring you into full screen mode, which gives you an unobstructed view of your map here, free from the toolbar and the legend. If you want to bring that back, you simply click on this to exit full screen, or you can use this keyboard shortcut right here, which is command or control period. That will quickly toggle that on and off. Now speaking of this left pane over here, this happens to be one of the biggest enhancements of the new Felt 2.0 UI redesign. It allows you to just more easily and intuitively work with layers. Previously, the legend list of data layers were located on the right side. This was a problem because you'd have to toggle between the legend and the style editor, meaning that as you made edits, you couldn't see the legend. We really wanted to make it easier and more fluid for power users to move between layers and elements as they style them. So we have this new left pane. So cool. So if I select this layer here, it'll bring up the style editor and now you can see everything's up on screen at the same time. And as I make adjustments over here in the style editor, these changes reflect over here in this left pane. And I can also turn off the visibility here. I can go over to another layer, make some changes here. I can change this to a categorical map, bring up the opacity. And you'll notice all the updates are reflected here over in the left pane in the legend. Now, quick pro tip, if you wanna leave your toolbar visible, but turn off the legend, you can use keyboard shortcut Shift-3 to toggle that off or on. And if you wanna simply jump between the list or the legend, you can use Shift-2 for list and Shift-1 for legend. All right, so there you have it, the new layout for Felt 2.0. Very beautiful, incredibly sleek. It's gonna speed up your workflow tremendously. So I urge you to jump in and give it a try. If you like this video and you want to see more content like this, if you want to keep up to date on all of Felt's new features, be sure to subscribe to our channel and activate notifications and go play around. Check out some of our playlists. We have a Friday features playlist, which focuses on all the new features. And we have a bunch of new content coming out that's just going to show you how to use Felt. So be sure to subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.